Peter never asked me what I wanted. My job is to pay. Here we are in the Italian coloring section. Um, this has actually been very good. I don't know if the lettuce comes from Gaza or not, but I think that uh, as a rule, we're, we're very happy with it, as long as the children do not throw them at great velocity at each other in the meantime. Here we have the piece de resistance, the most beautiful, wonderful locks we've ever seen at a bar mitzvah kosher with Pesach. This makes us all very happy and is well worth the price of the bar mitzvah all by itself. It's just a secret between us. And this is also something very special, lasagna. Once again, the Italians have won the day. Can I put it here, please? Thank you. Personally, I like to suck this stuff up through a straw. I would take it through hypodermic, but it's bad form under the circumstances. Here is potato salad. It's not exactly all the most famous thing here, so I'm just going to have a little dash so that nobody's insulted. Matzah, 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 bamidbar. Obviously, this butter is not up to snuff. So I'm going to take a little bit for Eliyahu Hanabi. Um, this is the second side of this side, so there's not too much interesting here, but come back later for the champagne. Okay, so now we move to the dessert table. This is the second leg of our tour. We'll start out with all kinds of wonderful colors and textures. We start off with brownies, the typical stuff for the white stuff. As you may know, we've always had kosher for Pesach brownies to celebrate David's Bar Mitzvah because it's on Pesach, so we've never been able to celebrate it properly with birthday cake. Stepping right over here, this is probably a custard concoction, I have no idea. Cheesecake, marvelous. It's Pesach now. We're not worrying about cheesecake yet, but I'm sure this is plenty of time to ask Mrs. Bernstein for the recipe before she was a little bit. Uh, what is this, Ben? Lemon rollada. Lemon rollon? Rollada. Pina clavada. It looks wonderful. I have no idea how to take this out with getting myself so sticky that it would become embarrassing. So we have tongs. Tongs would be wonderful. Watch, this is how it's properly done. Leverage. On, this is something we need to work on, a special rollata technique. Now, these are the things most detestable to half of the population of the human planet. However, we don't have much of a choice. These are probably chocolate macaroons. Am I correct in this? Wonderful for children, keeping them quiet. Once again, great when thrown at great velocity between the children. Here we have the semi-citrus table. Uh, melon balls of red and green variety, slices of orange and cute little cuts here. Um, wonderful. As long as nobody knocks it over. Is, that, is there any chance somebody can knock it over? They did already. They did already. Marvelous. Tongs would be a wonderful invention. That's just my personal opinion. Stepping a little bit further over here, this is uh, 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 subtitles, please. Moose. Pie. Moose. This is the Canadian national dish. We would put a maple leaf in the middle, but um, somebody has put something else in the middle in the meantime. We'll take this out of the way. This That's looks like cherry cherry cheesecake. cherry cheesecake. Well, what kind of cheesecake is this? That's Thank you. That's what? Lemon. Lemon cheesecake and cherry cheesecake. Wonderful. And that about wraps it up from the dessert table. Come back later when it's all gone, and I'll tell you where it's hiding. Till then. Oh, 